He may have swapped his scrubs for sequins while he performs on Strictly Come Dancing. But after almost four years on Holby City as Dr. Rafaela Raff Di Lucca, Joe McFadden could be hanging them up for good. After catching the dancing bug, the hunky soap star has set his sights back on the stage. In an exclusive interview, Joe said, Strictly has given me the hunger to do live entertainment again, perhaps a little play or a musical. It's sort of given me a hunger for going out into the world and doing other stuff. So perhaps my time might be coming to an end in the near future, is all I'm saying. Now I've got the dancing feet, it would be a shame to not do a little musical instead or disco dancing. But it hasn't just been the dancing Joe, with Strictly partner Katya Jones, has fallen in love with. The actor revealed he has taken to the tanning sessions too. Joe added, I've discovered I'm quite slow at picking up steps, I bruise easily, and that I enjoy fake tans more than I thought I would. I'm doing the fake tans every week, it's all part of the experience. I in fact, I went double dark the other day. It's like a color chart where you choose. Despite loving the bronzed look, Joe still needs to get his head around some of the restrictive costume designs. He said, Some of the things are quite surprising, like your shirt is attached to your pants, which I found quite odd in the beginning. And being stitched into things, they always stitch you in just in case buttons pop open, unless they are supposed to be open for things like the Paso Doble. With his Holby experience, I thought Joe would be used to stitches. It's been 11 years since comedy show The Kumars at NO42 was last shown on BBC One. But let's hope cast member Indira Joshi can bring some of its mirth to the residents of Albert Square as she joins Dreary Stenders. Indira played the mother of Kumar's host Sanjeev, better known as Sanjeev Baskar, who is now one of the lead characters in ITV drama Unforgotten. In EastEnder she will play Mariam, the aunt of Masood Ahmed who will return to the soap later this year. She will be joined by his uncle Arshad, played by Madhav Sharma, as the feisty Ahmed family move into the area in the new year. A few laughs may even give the show a much needed ratings boost. He's known for talking the talk, but Piers Morgan needed to walk the walk for his new documentary tonight after coming face to face with a brutal killer. The controversial Good Morning Britain host's latest show, Serial Killer, sees him meet violent Mark Reeve, who is serving life imprisonment for murder in the US. But in an exclusive interview, Piers reveals how he sat just feet away from the monster without a backup plan, explaining, in his case, he is a sniveling coward, but he's also a serial killer.
He's doing life without parole, he had nothing to lose, and he was losing his temper. There's a guard 20 yards away, and he's sitting just a few feet away. It is intimidating when you think about it. This guy could just reach over and attack you at any moment, and there isn't really a backup plan. The only plan from the producers is to keep the cameras rolling. It might do wonders for the ratings, but I'm sure Susanna Reed would miss him in the mornings. As if finding a wedding dress isn't stressful enough, Vicky Patterson will hunt for hers with cameras in tow. But she has recruited professional help ahead of her marriage to John Noble in the shape of Princess Diana's dress designer David Emanuel. He will be giving Vicky a hand in TLC series Say Yes to the Dress UK next year. Vicky said, David's got his work cut out with me and my entourage. I'm hoping he'll help me find the one or two. If not, he's going to get it in the ear from my mom.